Hey guys, I'm Will Dabbs, and today we're going to talk about the IWI Israel Weapon Industries Galil Ace Gen 2 Modern Sporting Rifle. This particular example is chambered for 5.56, but this rifle comes in 5.56, it comes in 5.45 by 39, 7.62 by 39, and 7.62 by 51. So it's available in four different common military calibers. Now this rifle has all the bells and whistles that you could possibly expect in an information age modern sporting rifle, but to fully understand the origins of this gun, we need to roll the Wayback Meter to the early 1970s and I need to fetch something else out of the gun room. This is an Israeli Galil assault rifle. Originally designed in the late 1960s, launched in the early 1970s, the Galil was a reflection of the country that produced it. Now, uh, the nation of Israel was birthed in 1948, the day after they declared independence. And so uh, early on, they for, uh, most often used uh, some FNFAL variant, but the FAL, superb rifle that it is, was designed for combat in Europe, and it did not fare terribly well in the deserts of the Middle East. And so in the early 1970s, they developed the Galil. Now the Galil is the elusive, effective compromise. The Galil is, um, kind of an arithmetic mean between a 5.56 millimeter M16, uh, original forged receiver AK-47, and the FNFAL. Those first Galil prototypes were actually built on uh, Finnish Valme receivers that were Ill illegally smuggled into the country. And so the basic action is a long stroke action from an AK, which is recognized as the most reliable assault rifle action in the world. The chambering is 5.56, comes from the M16, and then the butt stock is almost identical to the side folding stock on an FNFAL. But everything about this Galil was designed to be rugged and robust in the harsh combat environment of the Middle East, and it's a very practical weapon. Um, has the big ranch gate safety on the right, but it also has a thumb safety on the left. You can easily charge it with either the right hand or the left. In the versions of the Galil that have a, uh, a bipod, it even has a built-in bottle opener. Uh, as I said, the Israelis are remarkably pragmatic with their weapons. And so the Galil served uh, with active service in the IDF, the Israel Defense Force, for years uh, alongside M16s that were given to Israel by the United States. And then in 2008, IWI upgraded this original Galil uh, to reflect information age standards in modern sporting rifles. The latest Galil Ace Gen 2 still orbits around a forged uh, steel receiver, but it has this uh, polymer fitting on the bottom that cuts down weight to a degree. Now this is still an exceptionally heavy gun. Uh, uh, empty, the weapon weighs 8 pounds, 12.6 ounces, and then you put a bunch of uh, cool guy stuff on it, lights, lasers, and optics, and the thing gets pretty heavy. And most of that mass is out towards the front of the rifle. Now that's uh, an interesting observation because particularly in this uh, 5.56 millimeter chambering, this thing shoots about like a 22. Recoil is all but non-existent. Now, uh, the buttstock is a standard M4 buttstock, so it slides in and out. It also will fold to the right for storage and easy transport. Um, the charging handle has been moved on this Gen 2 Ace from the right to the left, so the weapon you can be run easily without taking your strong hand off of the pistol grip. And the safety selector is easy to manipulate with the strong side thumb. Now this is truly an exceptional rifle, and I'm not the only guy to think that. Uh, the Galil Ace has been adopted by a wide variety of uh, relatively modern militaries. It's the standard issue rifle in Chad and Cameroon, as well as uh, Vietnam. I have seen these Ace rifles in uh, news feeds from Haiti relatively recently. Haiti is a ghastly place that is forever um, struggling with anarchy, but uh, the Ace rifle is well in attendance there in Haiti. So uh, that's enough jabber. Let me get my eyes and my ears. I'll load a few rounds in this magazine and I'll show you how she runs. 
All right, I'm back. I've got my eyes, I've got my ears, I've got a loaded 30 round magazine in our Galil Ace Gen 2. Everything about this rifle is designed for efficiency. The magazine well is flared for fast magazine changes, the mag release is bilateral, controls as is the, the safety. Uh, everything about the gun is easily accessible. Just uh, check this out. That is one smooth shooting rifle. So there you have it. The reliability of the AK, the soft shooting characteristics of the American 5.56 by 45 millimeter round, though as I said, the rifle is available in three other calibers as well, and superb ergonomics. Uh, inspired and designed by some of the most capable small arms designers on the planet. That is a brief overview of this IWI Galil Ace Gen 2 modern sporting rifle. It is truly a superb weapon. MSRP on this rifle is $1,979, which is certainly not cheap, but it is in keeping with uh, about what you would pay for most any truly high-end modern sporting rifle in America today. So, I'm Will Dabbs. As always, I appreciate your time. You guys have a great day.